All right, folks, welcome back to Karak Alvaron's Gaming. We're back in Valheim, and today we have another seed video. Um, if you're a frequent flyer on my channel, you know that I like to discover seeds that have maypoles, and we have one. And this one's actually a f pretty damn good one, I think. I think this one is, is very, should be very highly rated. So before I get going, let me say thank you. Thank you for taking your time to watch my content. I really appreciate it. Please smash that like button. Please subscribe. Please share the video. All that stuff really helps the channel out and it keeps me motivated as a creator. I really, really appreciate it. Now this seed is one that I found on Reddit from um, a guy named Jason Uncensored. Now Jason Uncensored actually turned me on to another seed that's on my channel that has a maypole. This guy, um, for some reason, has a nose for good seeds with maypoles. Um, and I'll leave a link to his Reddit thread in the description below. Um, definitely check it out. Uh, he found the seed, I didn't find it on my own. But without further ado, there's the maypole, and if you look, this thing is right on the water on this natural little bay here. Um, directly out there is just open ocean. This is a nice natural little bay with maypole right on it. Small little village, it's nothing special. Um, so right off the bat, we've got a maypole on the water. Now, obviously you can go into cheat mode and put and build a maypole anytime you want. But if you're not doing that, um, you can no longer build maypoles on your own, so you have to go out and find them. So this is exceptional because of how close it is to the water and how open the water is. It's not like there's a bunch of little rocks out there or anything. And this is like a natural little bay, so it's good. Now, the downside is, is this is not on the starter island. Now, you can get there. Well, uh, let me rephrase that. It's it's one big continent. You're going to have to run up here, and you're going to have to go through a lot of crap to get here. <laughs> okay, but you can run up to it. So, um, it, there's that. Um, or you, again, if you're using cheat mode, you can just fly over to it. It's about at 11 o'clock on, if you looked at the spawn, it's at about 11 o'clock. Pretty high up there, and we'll check out the, the Valheim map in a minute. So, again, this is from a guy called Jason Uncensored. He has you know he's discovered other seeds with um that he's posted on reddit i've done a video on one of his other ones again that one was exceptional as well this one is uh exceptional too it we're going to have very close proximity to the trader close proximity to bosses very good resources overall i would give this seed probably a nine so let's take a look at the map so right here is the spawn okay you can see and the maypole that we're standing at is up here. Now you can technically run to it. You come right up this, right up here. Okay. So there is no boat involved. However, you're going to have to go through this green, this this uh, dark forest. Maybe that's a pain for you. Maybe it isn't. Um, but this maypole is right on this little, this little natural alcove right here. It's a really really nice port. Now where are the bosses? So, within running distance from the spawn, of course, you've got the Elder you can run up to, and then you can run to Bone Mass, and then you can do Motor. The Agloth is over here, um, which is, you know, uh, you do have to travel, but you've got three bosses and uh, four bosses right here. Um, that's pretty good. You've got plenty of resources right here. You've got plenty of Dark Forest, you've got Mountain Biome, and you've got this Bone Mass Swamp right here. Um, you may never have to get into a boat if you don't want to. Next big thing, where's the trader? Boom, right here, also within running distance. So, you may be setting up up here your base. Um, I could see maybe, let's real quick do a um, troll cave. I can see maybe setting up a port right here at this troll cave. Right, troll caves are great. You clear them, you can, you know, drop a port in there, and boom, you're right at the trader. Um, and then that may be your kickoff point to heading up to these other bosses. I don't know. It depends on how you want to build. But I think this is, a pr this is a great location for the trader. And these three bosses are right here, which is fantastic. Okay. 
Um, let's take a look, quick look at tombs and crypts. So, again, uh, not bad. You've around this maypole, you've got plenty of, of dark forest crypts. Okay, you're not going to have any problem getting your certainly cores and your resources there. Um, number two, the bone mass. Okay, there's plenty of sunken crypts around here. Um, it looks like there's five or six, so maybe I shouldn't say plenty, but um, I think that's going to be enough. You should be able to pull enough iron out of there to do what you need to do. Um, what else do we have? We've got the trader. Oh, yeah, we've got the mountain biome here, which has plenty of crypts as well. So, what else can I show you? Leviathans. Not that many, but enough. Um, you've got two right here and another one right here. Um, they're close enough. You're not going to have to sail all over the world to get to them. So that's good. Um, beehives. Not, I mean, enough. If you're on the main uh, over here, you've got plenty. Okay. You've got four pretty close right here in proximity to your maypole. So that's good. Um, it's, they're always nice to have. Great early food, um, etc. Dragon eggs. Boom. This mountain right here is fantastic. You'll be able to get everything here if you so choose. Or if you want to set up a camp up here, you can get the three that you need right near motor. So there's plenty of dragon eggs, uh, which is nice. Useful runes, which are the uh, boar spawns. Okay. Not that many. Okay, you've got one on this little inlet, on this little chunk of uh, meadows where you're going to build your your maypole sleeping headquarters. Um, I don't know if that's going to be enough. To, I mean, you'll be able to pull them in and start your boar camp here, but um, you like to see a little bit more than that near where you're going to build your base. I do, anyways, because you you know getting a two-star boar unless you spawn them through the cheat um, it can sometimes be tricky, but Overall, um, I would say that this is a very, very good seed. Now, why it's not a 10 is because of Yagloth. Okay, Yagloth, you've got to actually, you know, you've, you've got to do some work to get to Yagloth, okay? Um, but, boom, right off the bat, I would say you run up here, get through as much, get, get as close as you can to this maypole. It's right on the water. It's a great location. Um... You've got plenty of meadow to pick from here. You should have no problem getting resources in this meadow, and you're surrounded by dark forest, but not too close where they're going to be raiding you. You're not right on the on the edge of the dark forest. And you've got this natural port here should you want to go on a boating adventure. I mean, at some point, this lands are going to open up, and we don't know if there's going to be a boss. We assume there is. And if there is... Um, you're going to have to get on a boat and travel there. Um, but if you start at... The, um, the, the starting stones here, you spawn. Um, again, I just... I got over here to do the video. Um, but if you head up in this direction, this is where all those bosses are. And they're all... You can run to them, okay? Uh, you, you, no boat required. So overall, I think this is a very good seed. I'll leave the seed um, description number, whatever, in the, the um, comments below, in the description below. I'll also leave it in the title of the video. It's right here. And again, this came from a guy. Um, well, here's his Reddit channel, uh, his Reddit um, thread, which I'll leave a link to, Jason Uncensored. This guy has a knack of finding very good seeds with maypoles somewhere near the water some of his seeds aren't maypoles near the water but he's usually when you see a post from him posting a seed it's he's found a maypole and he's found the bosses are fairly close with adequate resources for you to do a speed run if you want to do a slow run if you want it's an exceptional seed i highly recommend it so i hope you enjoyed this video and you should stay tuned because i will be posting on more Valheim video seeds soon. I don't know where I'm going to go if I'm going to take another one of Jason Uncensored and do a video on that. Um, this guy's, like I said, found plenty of them, or I've got a couple that I found on my own that I'm going to explore. Anyways, thanks so much for watching this video, and we'll talk to you again soon.
Wrong button. <laughs>